My name is Princess Ilagan, 16 years old from grade 11 Pasture. For today's video, we will talk about importance of active citizenship and ways to be a good citizen. But before we start, I'll give you some information about citizenship. Mm, so what is citizenship? Do you have any idea? Mm, none? Anyone? So yeah, here we go! Citizenship is generally used as a synonym for nationality, where citizenship is used in a meaning that is different from nationality, it refers to the legal rights and duties of individuals attached to nationality under domestic law. In some national laws, citizenship has a more specific meaning and refers to rights and duties that can only be exercised after the age of majority such as voting rights or to rights and duties that can only be exercised in the national territory. Now that you have an idea about citizenship, we can now identify the importance of active citizenship. Active citizenship means citizens taking opportunities to become actively involved in defining and tackling the problems of their communities and improving their quality of life. As we understand it, active citizenship is a combination of knowledge, attitude, skills, and actions that aim to contribute to building and maintaining a democratic society. Active citizenship supports democratic cooperation that is based on the acceptance of universal human rights and the rule of law, values, diversity, and includes the whole community. Education towards gaining this knowledge and developing and practicing the skills take place in all levels of our shared social life, but schools play a very important role in it. I think the importance of it is you can share your knowledge and develop your skills at the same time by helping your community as an active citizen. Also, you can help your country to be a better place because you, as a citizen, has a contribution to make it happen. <laughs> That's all for the importance of active citizenship. Now, we can now proceed to ways on how to be a good citizen. Ten ways to be a good citizen. First, volunteer to be active in your community. Second, be honest and trustworthy. Third, follow rules and laws. Fourth, respect the rights of others. Fifth, be informed about the world around you. Sixth, respect the property of others. Seventh, be compassionate. Eighth, take responsibility for your actions. Ninth, be a good neighbor. And ten, protect the environment. What it means to be a good citizen? To be a good citizen, anywhere, you have to be a good person. That means showing respect, having a good attitude, or just helping others. In that way, you can call yourself or you can be a good citizen. Always remember that. That's all for today. I hope you learned something about the importance of active citizenship and ways to be a good citizen. I really do appreciate if you learned something new about this lesson. So yeah, thank you for watching!